All right, now let's explore some techniques for the back functional line. It begins, as we'll demonstrate on Annie here, with the latissimus dorsi, and this tendon right here is the lat coming down in the back of the armpit. So if you just take and use the back of your hand to press that into the rib cage, and then I'm going to have Annie just fold down over me. And now lift your elbow straight up towards your head, and I ease down the back of the armpit toward her lower back. That's going along the middle of the latissimus. Essentially, I am pinning and stretching here. I'm pinning the latissimus against the scapula and the ribs and urging the humerus up. I'm just guiding her. She's doing it as she lifts it up. How's that feeling, Annie? Does yeah, it, it feels wonderful. It feels <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> uh, that's great. So there should be a feeling of opening and stretching here, maybe especially the first time you do it, a little bit of burning, but um, not tearing or pain, any of that. You can do this usually two or three times and change your position slightly because the lat is such a big triangular muscle. Okay, now go ahead and take your arm up and down again and you can feel the difference that that provides. Yeah, feels very free. Okay, so Elaine, let's give this a try. So bring her arm up. Yeah, give it a hold, and bring your fist right into the corner. That's a very loose fist, just the back of your fingers. Yep. And the idea here is to take it down toward her hip, not up towards her shoulder. Yep. How's That's the pressure? Great. The pressure feels good. And then just get her arm to move away from you. So most of the work is happening in her movement stretch, not so much in your pressure. That's good. We saw a similar technique in the lateral line uh, in opening this up. Technically, the lat and the teres are part of this functional line, um, but it does help open up the side as well as this line going across the back. All right, let's try this again. And this time, see if you can drop your shoulder, your own shoulder, down onto your ribs and make this come from your hips. That's it. Good. Good. Sweeping down across the back. And as you go more to the back, she reaches more to the forward. And that's going to increase that stretch. Good deal. I feel that? Yep. And the, yeah, the bra is going to stop you, but you can kind of jump over that if you want to and pick it up right there. Yep. Okay. And Annie, you reach and reach, and you're going right for the midline of the back there. Beautiful. I'd say she's got it, don't you? Mm -hmm. yeah. I think so. I think so too.